Now Boo's interested. Now he's interested. Boo, don't eat it. Stella, Splash, Simba, Hydrox, and Boo. The Lucky Ferals. How you doing, Simba? I don't know why Simba has so much energy right now, but he does. I think it's because he wants some S-A-R-D-I-N-E-S. -E Simba, you had crunchies like everyone else, okay? Everyone had crunchies tonight. Tomorrow we have fish, okay? Okay, Simba, tomorrow we're having fish for breakfast. Okay, he's purring. He's so fluffy. Simba's so fluffy. I'm not sure where Splash is right now. He might be downstairs. I don't think he's hiding. I think he's probably downstairs. Okay, Simba, you have a good night. Did you have a nice day today? Simba says it was cloudy and rainy. And when it's cloudy and rainy, there's not enough animals outside to watch. He says on a sunny day, there's more to watch. Okay, maybe it's going to be sunny tomorrow, Simba. Maybe, right? Okay, you have a good night. You have good night, Simba. Simba, you have such pretty fur. You're such pretty colors. Good morning, Boo. Good morning, Stella. Stella slept on the bed all night. Then when I get up, she get up. Hello. Good morning, Simba. Are you watching bugs? You watching the bugs? Good boy. Boo says he wants some pets this morning, but not when he hears other cats coming in the room. How you doing, Boo? Boo loves being brushed, but he has a hard time, like, sitting still when he gets brushed. He likes to move around. Boo, you're so handsome. Do you tell me? He hears the other cats. For breakfast today, the cats are having a can of this wholehearted tuna and salmon recipe flaked in gravy. Once a week, I'd like to give them some kind of canned fish food, and this is what they're having this week. They should enjoy it. This morning I opened a can of salmon for humans, like not salmon for cats, but salmon for humans. And before I threw out the can, I realized
there's quite a bit of liquid in it and I checked the label and it's no salt added like the only ingredients were salmon and water so I poured any of the juice that was left in this little crunchy plate and look who found it splash found it and splash really enjoyed it look at that good boy splash what a good boy So Splash just got a little treat. This stuff is like crack for cats. So after Splash licked up all of the salmon liquid that was in that little plate, then I was in the living room and I was working on my laptop computer. I'm sitting on the couch trying to get something done on the laptop. And Splash came up to me and he was meowing and meowing and meowing. And I'm like, what's the matter, Splash? And he wanted more salmon and I was like, okay. So I came in the kitchen and I grabbed him a few pieces of this salmon. This is the like half of that can. And I gave him the salmon on a little crunchy plate under the dining room table because that's where he was at the time. And he ate it like he inhaled it. Here's the empty plate. And then Stella went over to him and she was trying to kind of get whatever was left on the plate. And Boo was looking around like, what's going on? So I gave him some salmon on this plate. There's Boo now, he's looking for some more. And I turn my back and the next thing I know, I hear like a huge cat fight. And the three of them, Stella, Splash, and Boo, are all fighting because of the salmon. And this is the salmon that I opened. Uh, this is the Trader Joe's uh, Wild Alaskan Pink Salmon. It's skinless, boneless, no salt added, which is very important, no salt added. And the ingredients are Alaskan pink salmon. There's also some liquid in here, so I'm assuming they also added a little bit of water, maybe not. And um, the sodium per serving is only 60 milligrams, um, which is just the naturally occurring sodium in the salmon. So I had no idea that the cats would go so crazy for this. Uh, but they have, but that's good for me to know because like instead of crunchy times sometimes uh, they could have salmon and uh, just hope they don't become like addicts. It's 6.45 p.m. and Stella was watching the centipede video on the tablet because she wanted to watch the videos. But I need to get a lot of stuff cleaned and organized tonight. So I put the centipede video on the big screen TV and that's what she's been watching now. This is her favorite centipede video. She's watching it on the big TV. I hope she can handle it. It is about 9 a.m. right now. And the cats are having their breakfast, so they're having homemade raw food with water mixed in. And they're also having a sprinkling of the canned salmon on top. There you go, guys. Eat your food. Where you going, Boo? Stella, Splash, and Simba are all eating their food. And here's Boo. For some reason, he did not want to eat with the other cats. So I moved his plate over here. And at first he turned up his nose at it, but then he gave it a second thought. So let's see if he eats it. Let's see if he eats it or if he just tries to eat the salmon off the top. Boo refused to eat his food without crunchies. So I put a few crunchies on top. And now I have to sit here and wait for him to finish his food. It's 9.30 a.m. I'm coming outside to give Hydrox some food and look at this. There's solid ice in all of the food bowls. Here's another bowl full of ice. Thankfully, the heated kitty cafe does not freeze. It's 11.35 a.m. Boo's hanging out in the round bed. He loves these round beds. Hello, Simba. Simba's sleeping with his eyes open. Right, Simba? Simba says, I'm not sleeping with my eyes open. I'm just resting. I like to keep an eye on what's going on in the room. He's keeping an eye out for bugs. Okay, Simba, you can relax. 
You can close your eyes and take a nap. You don't have to look for bugs all the time. There's Splash. Splash is hanging out on the bed. How you doing, Splash? And if Splash is on the bed, you know, Stella's usually not too far away. There's Stella. How you doing, Stella? It is mail time. Let's finish opening up this box from Henry Hazel. It has been a ridiculously busy week, so I apologize for the delay. But uh, let's see what else is in here. We have a package of delectable stew. This is chicken and tuna. It says it is a lickable treat. The cat should like trying this. And here's two more pouches. This one is tuna and whitefish, and this one is chicken and tuna. Thank you so much. And here we have a rockin' laser cat toy. It says laser light bounces across floors and walls as rockin' laser rocks. Weighted base keeps rockin' laser moving. Motion activated on and off switch. This will be interesting to see if the cats like this. I've never seen this before. Thank you. And check this out. Here's a package of Pure Bites. This is holiday turkey snacks. That's really cool. I've never seen these before either. What I've done with the Pure Bites in the past is use them as toppings on their food instead of crunchies. I'll like crumble one of these up and the cats like it that way too, so thank you. And look at this holiday fun pack. Oh my gosh, it's a holiday fun pack full of cat toys. 24 toys. A lot of them filled with catnip. Oh my gosh, look at that. The cats will go crazy over those. And then this says reverse advent donation. And here we have some cat toys for the reverse advent calendar. Now the reverse advent calendar has been finished and everything in it has been donated, but I can hold on to these for the next donation that I make to a local shelter. I might do one for Valentine's Day, which is coming up, so I could pass these on with a Valentine's Day donation. And if I don't do Valentine's Day, I'll definitely do one for Easter. So thank you much, Henry, I will pass these on. And look at these bag ties. These are so cute. Look, they're like cats sticking their tongues out. Do you see those? There's a black cat, a gray cat, and a white cat. These are so cool. Look how cute. And check this out. Look at this water bottle. It's a sip by swell insulated water bottle. Cold up to 24 hours and hot up to 12 hours. This is a 15 ounce bottle and it has cats all over it. Do you see that? Isn't that cute? I'm always using reusable bottles. Um, so this is great. This is definitely going to come in handy. And it is stainless steel inside, which is what I look for. I usually use stainless steel or glass. I try to stay away from plastic whenever I can. It says this is double walled insulated stainless steel and this bottle is built to keep your favorite drink at your preferred temperature. So, so this is great, thank you. So I usually keep a bottle of room temperature water uh, downstairs where I prepare the cat's food and I can even use this for that purpose and uh, keep filtered water in it instead of having to buy bottled water all the time. I can just use this to hold some filtered water and use that for the cats. So thank you. And here's another bag of Pure Bites holiday turkey snacks. These look really good. I really like the festive packaging. Hopefully the cats will like these too. Thank you so much for this awesome package of goodies, Henry. And Boo has decided to join me. It looks like he woke up from his nap. So the cats have been on the schedule where they get up in the morning and they go about their day. And then when they have their breakfast, right after breakfast, they all take a nap. And they usually nap until the afternoon. And then they all get up and then they're active for the afternoon and the early evening and then they have their dinner and after they have their dinner they take another nap and then they're up and active for a little while until they go to bed for the night uh, which is usually probably around midnight and then they sleep so they actually sleep three times a day that's been their schedule
And here's another package that arrived in the mail. This is a pretty big bag. So we're gonna open this one next. What'd we get, Boo? What'd you get? I wonder if this is a cat bed. Whoops. What is it? It has like a framework? Boo's afraid of it. It feels like a cat bed. So there's the, this looks like a cushion. Is, that a, is it a tufted cushion? And look at this, it's like a tent. Wow, look at this, look. It's like a tent. I've been wanting to get the cats a tent and look at this. I think Stella might like this. It's almost like something out of like Arabian Nights or something. That is so cool. And it's really big too. That could probably fit Stella and Splash at the same time. I don't know who this is from though, because there's no card or anything in it. So uh, if you sent this awesome cat bed um, to the cats, let me know. Please leave a comment below this video. Uh, and thank you very much. And we have one more piece of mail. This is from Zoa. It's a Valentine's Day card. It says it's Valentine's Day. Wishing you love always and forever. Happy Valentine's Day from Zoa and Marty. Thank you so much, Zoa and Marty, for this cute card. Happy Valentine's Day to both of you also. Is anybody going to check out the new bed? You going to go in there? You going in? The netting might freak them out. There he goes. Is he going to go in? Is he going to hang out in there? I could see Simba liking this bed a lot. Oh yeah, there's plenty of room. Oh my gosh. You could easily fit two cats in there. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Simba likes it. Simba says he's going to Enjoy it in there. Boo's laying in the sun watching Hydrox. The minute I turn the camera on, he gets up. It's 6 p.m. Look who's been hanging out in the new cat bed. Stella's been hanging out in there. Cats really like it. You like it in there, Stella? Stella says she likes it. 
She likes it because she could get away from everyone. Boo's watching videos on the tablet while he sits in the scratch and roll. They like watching videos on tablets better than on the big screen. I'm here with Boo and I thought I would show you what I bought the other day. So I was in the city and I was in Chelsea Market and there's a store there called Pearl River and I think it's all Japanese items in the store. And they had these Japanese lucky cats and I have a few Japanese lucky cats in my house. Um, I have a gold one and then I think I have a white one. Um, I think I have a blue one. I have a few different ones. But I saw this one and it reminded me of someone. So I bought it and I thought I would show it to you uh, as I unbox it. Look at this lucky cat. It's a lucky black cat. And obviously the arm moves. I think it's solar. Oh no, this one is battery operated. It reminded me a whole lot of Boo, so I bought it. And I'm hoping it will be lucky. You're supposed to put this on a shelf or a piece of furniture and it's supposed to face the door. So I am going to put a battery in this and then I'm gonna put it on a shelf facing the front door and we'll see what kind of luck it brings. But look, right now, there's no battery in it. The arm's moving, there's no battery in it. Maybe it will eventually come to a stop. What is that, Boo? What is it? What is it, Boo? It's a black cat like you. It's a lucky black cat. You're a lucky black cat, too. You like it? There's still no battery in it. Keeps moving that arm. There's no battery in it. It takes a AA battery. And this is what it looks like with the battery in it. Now Boo's interested. Now he's interested. Boo, don't eat it. Boo, it's good luck. It's good luck, it's you. Okay, so who knew this would be a really Good cat toy. The centipede video is on a few feet away. That's what the noise is. It's running on the tablet. It's about 8.15 p.m. and look at Stella. Stella's so comfortable in this new bed, look. She's so happy. It's like a princess bed. Stella, you love your bed. She says she loves it. She says thank you to whoever sent it. Look how cute Stella is. She's so cute in that little tent. Like a bed tent. And here's Boo. Boo's hanging out in his feather boa. Do you like the boa? You look very handsome in your boa. Thank you for watching this Lucky Earl's video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe if you'd like me to post more videos, and please make sure to check out these other videos that were selected especially for you.